All right, let's go ahead and address some. Um, did Jesus have faith? I think I'm going to title this video that. All right. So the reason why I brought this up is because I know this is um, this has been a very touchy subject here lately um, and actually for a while. Um, and so uh, what I wanted to talk about is faith in and then faith of and the difference between the two. So faith in equals our faith, right? Our faith in the gospel, uh, you know, by grace through faith, uh, we are saved, right? Uh, and then the faith of is, um, you know, the faith, the faithfulness of, of Jesus Christ, right? Um, I guess I shouldn't say it that way. Faithfulness. Uh, no, I'm talking about the, the, the faith that Christ had. Okay, so faith in is found in Acts chapter 24, verse 24, Galatians 3, 26, Ephesians 1, 15, Colossians 1, 4, and 2, 5, 1 Timothy 3, 14, and 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 13 and uh, chapter 3 verse 15 and so the faith of Christ is found in Galatians 2 16 and Philippians 3 9 used in the sense of faithfulness of Jesus himself right so Jesus had faith I don't I don't I don't care what these uh, uh what these people out here are telling you uh, faith of means uh, Jesus became flesh God became flesh right uh, through Jesus Christ and that is how um, and so obviously he felt the same exact things we feel uh, the only difference between him and us is he never sinned right because he was God so uh, but he felt everything we felt he had the same feelings we had he he uh, he was in a fleshly body just like we are he bled and he died on that cross just as we would do right the only difference is he got up, he resurrected, um, and obviously we will one day uh, simply because of that. <clears throat> okay, so uh, this also applies in Romans chapter 3, verse 22, the faith of Jesus Christ, Galatians 2.20, faith of the Son of God, and also Galatians 3.22, the faith of Jesus Christ. This is why Paul says faith to faith, and then he adds that we believe in Jesus Christ to be saved by the faith of Jesus Christ. It's not that hard to understand. Jesus Christ had faith. That is the meaning of faith to faith. So anyone that goes against the Word of God, uh, what the Word of God clearly teaches us, uh, which is Jesus had faith, they need to be marked and avoided. Don't let someone come along and tell you that you are saved by your own faith. That's false. That's heresy is what that is. Uh, that's just scripturally inaccurate. It seems as if they get one thing wrong and they refuse to be corrected on it. That you keep finding more and more that they have missed the mark on. And don't worry, they won't be corrected on that either because pride has taken over. So, hey, um, just allow the word of God to be true and every man a liar, right? Uh, prove everything that someone says with the Word of God. Prove exactly what I'm telling you right here with the verses that I've gave you. Uh, and I'll, I'll put these in the description. All right? Well, y'all have a great rest of your weekend. Grace and peace.